رمضان تجلى وابتسم طوبى للعبد إذا تنما Should I focus on reading more Quran or praying more Nafil prayers or helping more people during Ramadan? This question usually comes in different forms. What is best? To make dhikr? To recite the Quran? Or to pray? What is best? To feed the hungry? To dig a, 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 a water well? Or to run a madrasa? To teach people? We don't have a measurement tool that would allow us to know which is more preferred to Allah Azza wa Jal. But every time or each period of time has a benefit more than the other. Each form of worship has benefits more than the other. So it depends on the situation. What do you mean? Quran, isn't it the word of Allah? Yes, indeed. Isn't it the best thing one can recite? Yes, indeed. Dhikr is less in degree than Quran. True? Of course it is. But if I am in sujood or in rukur, can I recite the Quran? No, you can't. It's totally prohibited. Hmm. So can I make dhikr? Of course, you have to make dhikr. In this case, dhikr in sujood or rukur is better than the Quran. But Quran, while in the standing position, nothing beats it. It's the best of all. So you have to know the situation, the person offering it, and the reward accordingly. Your question was related to reciting the Quran. Nafil prayer or helping people. If there is someone who's starving to death and needs my immediate help or he'll die, and I'm saying, no, I'll have to finish Al-Baqarah first. Definitely I'm doing the wrong thing. Close your Quran and go and help. If it is time for Fajr prayer and I'm reciting the Quran, I, I'd like to finish a couple of pages. The, the prayer is ongoing. Close and go and pray. If I'm praying Fajr, and someone has, has a heart attack next to me and he falls. And I said, may Allah make him better, inshallah. I'll finish the prayer. No, cut your prayer and help him. Each situation dictates what becomes better or best. It depends on the situation. So likewise, should I recite the Quran 24-7 during Ramadan? Or should I engage in dhikr? Or should I engage in salutation to the Prophet ﷺ? Or should I pray? This depends on what's closer to your heart. Sometimes I pray for a couple of hours and I'm tired. So I sit down and I engage in offering salutation to the Prophet ﷺ for 10 minutes. And then I start to pray again. Good. Sometimes I recite the Quran for three hours and then I don't feel like being fed up, but I'm tired of reading the Quran. Exchange this for reciting the reading the seerah of the Prophet ﷺ, or reading something beneficial, or engaging in dhikr. So always do what is best for your heart and you feel that is uh, good for you, inshaAllah.